Whoop. Bubble wrap. <laughs> it's, it's like a lot of. <laughs> it's a lot of bubble wrap. Bubble wrap. Bubble. Wow. <laughs> Okay, uh, and uh, and this is bag with keyboard. I'm so excited, guys! So yeah, no box, um, just a simple bag inside a bubble wrap. But it's okay. For Fifty dollars, I can do. Okay, so we have TRRS cable. And it's it's super shitty. It's seen and I not like it. But I think it's worth so, nothing to complain about. For 50 bucks. I already can see this keyboard inside. Final cut. Wow 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 guys. And one more final cut. Unboxing is not my. <laughs> I should have an exercise right there. Oh. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Oh, it's so sweet. So sweet, small keyboard. I like it. I don't like the feel, uh, I don't like the feel of the switches. I think it's brown. Okay, let's finish it. So, that's it guys, that's it. We have a keyboard, split keyboard. Okay, so, what do we have here? It's uh, Silica 54 from AliExpress, for less than 50 bucks. Yeah, actually, yeah, <laughs> there's a few bucks with key cups and switches. So actually, it looks okay. So I'll join this fine. The whole feel of the keyboard is fine, I think. Yeah. This looks okay. Have a, a I think gray wood lambok switches. Actually, I don't like the feel. I think I'll swap them for some aqua cream yellow or leather lavender. Yeah, because this one I don't like. Uh, yeah, and then a keyboard comes without this anti slit legs, so it's not staying good on the table. Okay, let's fix this one. Uh, let's fix this problem. I have some legs laying around. Let's fix them on the keyboard. Okay, why I'm putting these legs? Uh, it's a funny story about this keyboard. It's a new one. It's come around three months ago and it's not really popular. It's a Reddit user from Finland making these keyboards for himself and uh, he was really... Uh, he was really popular one day when uh, his keyboard is come like 20 more listings on AliExpress. Yeah, and that's why I bought it. I want to check if the keyboard for it's this guy. Wow. Wow. Now we're talking. Shit. <laughs> okay, sorry. My legs is shit. Okay. Now, now, now I have a different feeling on this keyboard. Like it's, it's clacky, but actually it's good. 
I don't like the feeling of it. Okay, may maybe, maybe it's just will save problem. Okay, let's do some more legs. Yeah, and I have USB C port. Cool. So RP twenty forty zero controllers. Chinese clone, I suppose. Okay. So I put some legs and just see. Oh yeah. That's better. Yeah, actually, I don't know. I like it for 50 bucks, it's been super good, uh, but maybe I don't like the feel because look at mine, not finished so far. Yeah, it looks cool. Maybe I don't like uh, keyboards without case, yeah, because it's without a case. This one with the case it looks nicer. I don't know. Okay, let's check what's inside. Shall we remove the back plate? Looks okay. They don't remove flux from the board to solder. Ah, oh, that's fine, I think. So, yeah, it doesn't look cheap. Looks like a normal keyboard, hot swap sockets, switches, really small diodes. I don't know. I think it's fine. Ah, and the controller is not socketed, it's soldered in. And so, okay. To finish this unboxing, finish this review. I want to say it's absolutely normal and working uh, mechanical split keyboard. So if you want to start, uh, start from it. And actually you can buy it with switches and keycaps. They, they, they okay. I think they're absolutely okay. I just, I just don't like the feeling of the switches. I don't like the feeling of the keycaps. I know it's too, mm, not clicky. Okay, not pleasant sound. This maybe maybe that's because I didn't make it myself. But actually, I can recommend. It's super nice, super cheap uh, wired keyboard for fifty bucks from AliExpress with switches and keycaps. Uh, if it's the beginning of a journey and you don't want to solder and order yourself, it's a pretty good start. Thank you guys.